Solar eclipse just a few hours away now. Excitement is certainly building as the path of totality is the place to be in a lot of places in our state that will be right there, including Holton, where members of our team have been since Friday. Amanda Hill and David Guilford join us from there now. Good morning, guys. Good morning, Lee and Sharon. It's a brisk beginning to <laughs> Holton here, but the sun is out, David, and gosh, it's going to be beautiful here. Absolutely stunning. Todd, you were right. We did build up some credits uh, during our trip in the RV this week. We hadn't really seen the sun since Wednesday morning. Yeah. And then it just snowed throughout. Yeah, you guys have been traveling all week long in this RV. You've met lots of interesting Mainers. Any fun stories stick out to you? Well, first off, it's it's crazy to think we started this journey on Monday at the Children's Museum in Portland, and everyone who we've met along the way and spoken with have just they've had a fantastic attitude about this. A lot of people have been looking forward to this for a long time. I mean, yesterday, of course, we talked to uh, the local celebrities like Tim Sample, but just the people who stick out to me are like a couple photographers who we met a couple days ago who okay. were taking Polaroids for anyone who wanted to come up, families, kids, to, to mark this occasion. And we asked them, honestly, like, tell us how you feel, because they're both locals here. And they said, it's a lot, all these people coming yeah. in. But they were so happy for the businesses yeah. that were just filled with patrons that are making money after COVID and after a really tough snowmobile season yeah. in the winter. Oh yeah. And just to wrap things up with them, I asked, what are you gonna do for the moment for the eclipse? And they said, we love the crowds coming here, but we're gonna close up our tent at like 2.30, rush home and have this, pr this private moment Aww. in our backyards with our family. Well, a lot of businesses, by the way, are handing out some of these glasses. I know a lot of people are asking, where can I get the glasses to watch the eclipse? And by the way, if you can't get glasses, They've got you covered with these giant glasses. These actually work. Well, I got to tell you, the town of Holton has been planning this for three years, yeah. we were told yesterday. So they are ready for the visitors. They need a bit defrosting. Yes. But the sun, before the it sun gets blocked, help. is going to heat us up quite a bit. It's going to be absolutely gorgeous here. Lee and Sharon. All right, thanks guys very much. And David and Amanda will both be part of our special coverage of the eclipse that starts at 2 o'clock this afternoon. Yeah, lots of people.